What's up my dolls? Welcome back to Nicole of course. As you guys can see from down in that title, today we are doing Pizza Hut. Yes, so today is Saturday and I might as well get some pizza for a late night snack or to snack throughout the day because I'm obviously not going to eat this all right now on camera. But before I dive in and let you know what I got, I'm going to pray, take a quick thumbnail, and then we can go from there. So let's pray. Father God, I want to thank you for this food. In Jesus' name, we So let's take a quick thumbnail. Okay. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I'm so excited, you guys. Okay, so what we have today is the dinner box. I think that's what it was called. And altogether, it was $30. I got it for delivery because I don't feel like leaving the house today. Like I said, it's a Saturday, so I'm trying to knock out some videos. Um, so while I'm doing this mukbang, my camera for um, my G7X is charging, and then I'm gonna go probably take like a 20, 30 minute break maybe start to edit a video and then do another one. Enough about videos, let's dive into this. So this side is just sausage and cheese. And this side, now for all the people who don't like pineapple on your pizza, sorry, not sorry. But on this side, we have chicken and pineapples with barbecue sauce on top. Mmm, yes, I am one of the people who like pineapples on their pizza. I think it's so good. We have some breadsticks and then also some chicken alfredo. Yum! Look how good that looks. Mmm. So let's dive right in. I got marinara sauce right here. It's kind of liquidy, to be honest. Weird. But I have some also that I poured in a bowl because I didn't know if they were going to give me enough or not. And I like a lot of marinara sauce with my breadsticks. So let's just dive right in. Mm. Mine's doing pretty well. I really want it to rain one of these days soon. <laughs> it's been pretty dry lately, to be honest, and I love those rainy days that we have here in Texas. I spilled some. Mmm. Mmm. That marinara sauce is not right. I don't know what's going on with that. Um, I'm gonna leave mine right here. Mm. 
I wanted to address something real quick. I'm sorry I'm slurping like that. <clears throat> With this cup, I really can't, <clears throat> I mean, I kind of help it, but it's just so big and the ice just wants to like fall all over the place. So if you're triggered by that, I'm sorry, but what I was going to say is the Miss A video that I have posted, I was doing two things at once while I was editing that video and I really didn't realize that it's some things replay or um, I didn't cut some things out. I am sorry for that. I apologize. It's just that it's bad to delete a video and repost it. So I'm just going to leave it alone. If you don't like it, then just simply just don't watch. Or if you don't mind, then just keep watching the video. I am sorry. I will definitely pay more attention to my editing. That was my fault, but let's just get it out of the way now and say it's better to just leave it up than take it down, fix it, and repost it. I don't know why. That's just how YouTube is, I guess. That's what I was told. Um, so we're just going to let it be, and if it bothers you that much, just don't watch that video. Mm. The pasta is good. I've been on a pasta kick lately, honestly. <laughs> mm. I still have not got my pesto pasta. Um, I was actually thinking about maybe just making it myself here at home and doing a video out of that. So let me know if you'd like to see that. So you guys said also that you liked my nails. I like them, but I do have a little issue with them. They are not exactly how I like them. Um, I can show you them up close. This is what they look like. They are matte green. But honestly, if you really, really look closely on the one with the diamonds, it's all messed up. I was just kind of frustrated at one point and I was just like, you know what, can we just cover it up with um, some diamonds so I can get out of here? I was in the salon for already like two hours, two and a half hours, and they're very, very nice people. Don't get me wrong. It's just, I got a pedicure and my nails done, and there was one person working on this hand, one person on this hand, and then when they would switch, they would fix each other's work, and, and it was just, it was driving me insane, honestly, and then at one point, I was like this, and my, my feet were, they were doing my feet and everything, and I was just like, okay, this is way too much going on, so each one kept on um, critiquing each other's work so they were just filing and filing and filing and filing at my nails and I was like okay like let's get this over with already this is like a five hour process by now <laughs> if I would have let them kept going I probably would have been there about two more hours very very nice people they just need to get one person for the nails one person for the pedicures and um that's it and call it a day so 
that's the reason why I didn't film and I haven't really showed you guys up close. Mmm. Mmm. good this piece is kind of basically all crust though <laughs> but this one's all pizza I mean all toppings and all that kind of stuff so I'm gonna move along to this one <laughs> I really should have bring a straw in here. So I went to the mall. Dun, dun, dun. <laughs> I, I went to the mall, did a little bit of Christmas shopping, and then bought some stuff for me. Which you guys will see in the video on hmm, Sunday or Monday, possibly. And it was um, different things that I usually wouldn't pick for my wardrobe. It was clothes and accessories. But um, I also picked up this pink shirt. Look at how cute it is. It's just a huge oversized t-shirt and it has a heart with the world in it. So cute. They had so many different types of designs. <laughs> I basically went to the mall because I had to pay my bill but then I also had a $10 credit basically for pink so <clears throat> paying my bill bought this shirt and then bought a long sleeve shirt like the black one that I have but in gray and then, oh, and then I also bought, oh my goodness, you guys. Okay, so I usually don't buy, <clears throat> like, sexy perfume, like, actual perfume, not, excuse me, <clears throat> not body spray. I usually tend to stick with and only wear Pure Seduction at Victoria's Secret. But I went ahead and bought some grown woman spray. <laughs> And it's the Bombshell Paradise. Amazing. It smells so good. And I, at my pink, it was 40% um, off for like the 1.7 size bottle. 
and it was yeah 40 percent off and then i got the lotion with it as well that's not on sale but it was like 25 dollars so it smells like uh, heaven it smells so good mmm I honestly like I'm only gonna wear it you know if I'm like going out or only in special occasions <laughs> I guess I might have it for a long time I don't really go out much or I haven't been <clears throat> but so <clears throat> the bombshell paradise is my favorite so it smells just so so good oh my goodness but I wanted to let you guys know I think there was a sale oh yeah there's a new tote if you spend $80 in case if there's any other pink lovers out there. Um, if you spend $80, you get a tote. It is like a green, like this color green, maybe a little bit lighter, tie-dyed kind of, you know, just like a regular tote that you would pack your stuff in to go sleep at your man's house for the night or best friend's sleepover, that kind of tote. And yeah, and then the 40% off of the perfume, but I don't know if that's at all location, so don't quote me on that. So basically, I just thought of this. Like I said, I was at Pink, um, you know, checking out the store <laughs> and pay my bill or whatever. But I wasn't sure if I should have bring this up or not. I know he probably could have been having a bad day or whatever the case may be. But honestly, the lady before me checking out, basically what I'm trying to say is the customer service at the cash register was very bad. And I've never seen him there before. He must have been new or something. Maybe from a different store and just filling in. Who knows what can be going on? And I'm not trying to judge. But he was very, very nice and playful with the lady before me. And when I come up there, he's like bare minimum talking and I'm like asking questions. And he's like, mm. Like for him, his yes was mm hmm. And I was just like, okay, like. In my head, I'm like, what's your issue? Like, what's the problem? I don't know. Maybe. Maybe you just didn't like me. Or whatever the case may be. I don't know. Again, I'm not trying to talk bad about this person. They could have been having a bad day, like I said. Or something going on in their life. Or he didn't want to be at the job. Different store. Da, da, da. 
but I just thought it was weird that he was all nice nice to the woman checking out before and for some reason he had an issue with me that's fine it's whatever it's cool I had those days too so I don't know if I should say this or not. <laughs> I was gonna say uh so should I like you know call up and say no I shouldn't be a Karen no actually thinking about it I'm not gonna do all that because whatever and I don't want to <clears throat> go to that extent but let me tell you if I go there again and keep getting that same service from him there's gonna be some issues <laughs> and corporate is going to be called. No, not corporate, but I was gonna call just the customer service number on the bottom of the receipt and kind of just let them know like, he was kind of rude a little bit. Mm -hmm. But I won't go that far, I'll take it slow. When I was walking out the store, I, I, I'm going to be honest with you, I was, I was so ready to just call and be like, listen, this person was super rude to me, like, I don't know. So that's my experience at the mall. <laughs> mm. I got Dalvin two things. I feel like he's going to love them. It's nothing big, it's clothing, but it's definitely his thing, his style, if you want to call it that. <clears throat> I like them a lot. <clears throat> and I'm really trying to save them. <laughs> save them for Christmas. But you know me, when I buy something, I just can't keep it a secret. Like, it's so hard for me. And then I just cave in and give it to him. But this one I'm really going to keep all the way until Christmas and not show him. I could have been done Christmas shopping by now if I didn't give him all the stuff. <laughs> mm. What about you guys? Have you guys had um, done any Christmas shopping yet? Are you guys early shoppers or last minute shoppers? <laughs> my mom, I get it from my mom basically. My mom always shopped throughout the year and she always shoved it in her closet. And that's why she would always like have a like a stacked, a whole bunch of stacked presents. Because also my birthday and Christmas are like super, super close. So Shopping throughout the year definitely helps out. Mm -hmm. What's your guys' wish list? Do people still make wish lists? I think I really, really want a, um, a full vanity um, beauty room set from, what is it called? impressions impressions vanity i want the mirror the desk i mean like the table whatever makeup table the other mirror that goes on it chairs i want everything from impression vanity i'm so grateful for anything that i get don't get me wrong but that's mainly like the one thing that i really 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 want Oh, or a new computer because my computer it's going down <laughs> it's literally like it's so slow when I'm editing it's it's it just takes a very 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 long time so impression vanity or um, new computer I'm trying to see if Dalvin's home. 
Might just be the washer and dryer. I don't know. We're clear. It's only the washer and dryer. Washer or dryer. They sing a little song after they're done um, <laughs> washing or drying the clothes. So I think that's what I'm hearing. If not, I need some cameras. <clears throat> no, literally, I don't do stuff like that. Mm-mm. I do not play around with stuff like that at all. I don't like it. Mm -mm. camera shut off I had to press play again but I actually did have a lot of this and I can save it for tonight <clears throat> and have a pizza party and watch some movies I don't watch scary movies alone but oh I forgot to mention I started watching Love Island UK I love it so much it's got me hooked. Honestly, like, who's super obsessed with everything? Like, super OCD with everything being perfect. I'm crazy. I have to have this. <laughs> I'm sitting here doing this, but I'm just going to mention it to you guys. I'm sitting here, and the pasta was kind of, like, not even evenly ate so I have to eat this part to just make it an even amount or like you know what I'm saying I don't know like at the gym when I'm running I can't have it at 5.1 it has to be at 5 um just 5.0 or 5.5 uh, it can't be like certain numbers together I'm so weird please let me know if or if it's <laughs> I'm a lot let me know if that's how you guys are because I feel like I'm so weird for that like things have to be perfect like oh I don't even know I'm very 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 OCD it's bad anyways back to Love Island UK, by the way, I didn't realize it was the UK version until I started, I clicked on it and watched it. I watched a little bit of it and I was like, okay, I like this. Plus, I love their accents so much. So, I was like, I'm going to watch this. And then one episode turned into like five. <laughs> and then I just, I started watching all of them. <clears throat> My, I forgot what. I actually, I don't know why it started from the last episode or season, I should say, but it started at the last one, so maybe someone else watched it. I don't know, but um, I'm the one with, I'm watching, currently I'm watching the one with Colm. Well, this is my favorite couple. If you don't know what I'm talking about, basically Love Island is an island that, um, it's reality TV. You go to a like a resort looking place, it's actually really, really cute. And people couple up with, women and guys couple up together and see if they actually get to know each other and like each other. And then they kind of add like some twists to it. That's basically the show. And my favorite couple is Colm and Shauna. Those are my favorite. 
And then I was liking, um, <clears throat> I kind of like Mike and Leanne, but I don't know. I don't know exactly like where they're at with their relationship right now, but I like them as a couple. And then I liked, um, I thought the other Connor with a G, if you guys know what, if you guys watch that show, you know what I'm talking about. And can I go on that show? <laughs> He's cute. He's really, really tall, really buff. But, yeah, if you don't watch that, watch it because it's really good. If you like reality TV shows like that, we suggest you watch it. So, after I'm done with the last season, I'm going to start over and watch the first one, um, which I think I'm almost done with it. So, that's what I'm watching currently. And then I want to start watching, uh, I think it's called like Crimes on the Internet or something like that. I love those kind of shows. Ice is so cold. <clears throat> All right, dolls. So I'm gonna end it off here. I hope you guys enjoyed this uh, mukbang chit chat updates um, on what I've been doing the last couple of days, basically, or what TV shows I have been watching. Oh, by the way, it's on Hulu. If you guys want to watch it, um, I just came across. By the way, I just came across the American version of it. I think it's, no, Australian. So I'm going to go ahead and watch that after I'm done with all of the other seasons on the UK one. Anyways, if you guys would like to follow me on my social medias, on Instagram, it's Nicole, of course, and on Snapchat, Twitter, TikTok, and Facebook, it's Nicole, of course, with two E's at the end. I'm going to end this off, you guys. If you got this far to the video, please leave a little pumpkin emoji to let me know who my true supporters are. I'm going to end this off. I love everybody. I love you, 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 you. Bye, dolls.